No, those are sharks! What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Barbie Sacks, the big one, not the little one. If you are a turning subscriber, welcome back, baby. If you are new here, do not forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave. So today's video is gonna be a birthday vlog, y'all. And if you can't tell, your girl is in another area, a new area, who this? <laughs> the girl is in Nassau, Bahamas, y'all. Tomorrow is my birthday, and today's video is gonna be a birthday vlog. So today is June 3rd, it is Saturday. My birthday is tomorrow, which is June 4th. Don't play with me. And when I tell y'all, it is so beautiful out here. Like, I literally mean exactly what I said. Like, it is so freaking beautiful. Beautiful. palm trees everywhere coconut trees everywhere flowers everywhere everything just lit period <laughs> y'all ever come out here to the bahamas make sure that y'all money is up okay let's just start right there make sure y'all money is up and not y'all funny because when i tell y'all groceries out here is so expensive i went to the grocery store earlier and y'all tell me why bread was literally six dollars i'm just sitting here like what this is bread like why is it six dollars y'all the bread was six dollars okay the bread was six dollars the cereal was ten dollars the milk was ten dollars like it'd have been better off if i just went out to eat because the prices is really doing a number like i don't understand why the bread was six dollars like the, it only come with like 10 10 pieces of bread everything out here is just so freaking expensive but i promise y'all it's worth every dollar like it's so freaking beautiful out here i love it i'm just so happy that i was able to come out here for my 27th birthday like i'm really feeling blessed like really feeling blessed <laughs> but y'all make sure y'all comment in the comment section below and you tell your girl happy birthday okay big 27 not the little 27 let's tell y'all the agenda for today so today we're going to the junkano beach y'all and it's supposed to be this beach that have a lot of stuff going on like a lot of activities and stuff so your girl really about to be outside on the beach y'all i don't know, I have nobody's sunscreen so i'm about to get so burnt out here like so burnt out here and if y'all can't tell the sun is really sunning okay baby the sun is really sunny like your girl about to go back home brown skin okay Hey, your girl is light skin on a normal day but i'm definitely gonna go back home brown skin as hell like <laughs> i don't know what other activities we're gonna get into but i guess we're gonna see when we get there okay Fall head first, and this is what's called. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, this one is getting deep. Oh. All right, y'all. So, we in the water. In this lit. <laughs> y'all, he is so freaking bossy. Like, you just don't know. Like, don't do that. With me. Like, I really hurt you out. Do my wig look messed up, y'all? I think I got to wet a little bit. But I'm still serving, okay? I'm still serving for the growth. So don't play with me. Happy birthday <laughs> to Bambi. <laughs> Happy birthday. You know we love you. <laughs> Happy birthday <laughs> to Bambi. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Today's my birthday. Yeah. Tell me happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> I'm telling the driver to give you the birthday special. Oh, thank you. Okay. <laughs> What's your name again? Barbie. Doll. Bobby? Yes. Okay, Bobby doll? Yes. Okay, Bobby doll. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Welcome to the Bahamas, okay? Thank you. Yeah, man. <laughs> so today's my birthday, and we are going parasailing. You excited, babe? Okay. Yeah. Oh. I'm scared. 
happy birthday to me. That was freaking scary. <laughs> a little bit. Wow, it is so freaking nice up here. Like, wow. Yo, this is freaking crazy. Wow. I ain't gonna lie, that pull off was something crazy. <laughs> oh my god, those are sharks. No, those are sharks. Those are sharks. Happy birthday to me, Big 27. Yeah. What's up, you guys? And today is my birthday. <laughs> Okay, today is my birthday, y'all. And if y'all do not tell me happy birthday, I'm gonna be very mad at y'all. Okay, let's just start right there. I'm gonna be very, very upset. So make sure y'all head in the comment section below and y'all tell your girl happy birthday. Like I just turned 27 today, y'all. And honestly, truthfully, like let's really talk about it. Can we talk about it? <laughs> like honestly, I've been feeling so grateful, so blessed. Like I can't even explain the feeling. Like to be able to see another year of life is honestly a beautiful thing. I know 27 ain't, isn't old or anything like that, but it's close to 30. Like, I'm damn near knocking on 30's back door. Like, hello? You feel what I'm saying? So, like, it's just a blessing. And it's so crazy because I remember when I was, like, 21 years old, I remember being like, oh, my God, I don't want to be 25. Like, that's old. And now I just look at life in a whole nother perspective. Like, it's really just so crazy how life just changes you. Like, not even life, but age changes you. Let's see, i just been feeling so blessed and so grateful to honestly just to just be here and just be able to say like I made 27 years of life like 27 years of like that's crazy like I honestly feel like I owe God so much praise y'all and literally when I get back home I just feel like I need to be in somebody's church house like that's how blessed your girl's feeling right now like no lie but I do want to say thank you so much for the ones who have told me happy birthday so far and it's on my Instagram thank you guys so much for telling me happy birthday y'all so today we had when Paris selling y'all when I tell you your girl was scared baby I was was scared let's talk about it let's really talk about it because <laughs> i was really scared because y'all when i tell y'all when they let, let us off the boat and that thing took us all the way in the air baby the girl was scared okay i was literally scared that was my first time ever going parasailing y'all i'm really not a heights type of girl like i do not like heights at all like i don't even play like that okay i don't even play like that Anytime i'm too high i'm like what's really tea like put your girl down it was just so crazy and it was definitely like an experience like oh yeah y'all by the way like i saw some sharks in the water and everything i was just like hold on y'all said it ain't sharks in this water and i see sharks <laughs> <laughs> like what's really going on <laughs> they're gonna tell me they was dolphins baby i think i know the difference between a shark and a dolphin i'm gonna make sure i include the footage for y'all so y'all can see for yourselves and y'all tell me if that was a shark or if it was a dolphin because don't play with me and don't play with my intelligence i know a shark when i see one and i know a dolphin okay and that was definitely giving shark Y'all, I had so much freaking fun. Like, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I was also supposed to go jet skiing today. Oh my god, it's a, it's really raining. <laughs> oh my god, y'all. So it really just started raining in the middle of my video. Like, <laughs> it looked like it's really about to, yeah, thunderstorm out here. Like, nothing out here. Like, it rained a freaking a lot since I've been out here. It's been raining. Like, the rain kind of been on and off. So I don't know if that's an island thing or what. But anyways, y'all. So like I was saying, um. <laughs> Today we had went Paris selling y'all and it was so freaking fun. Like I just, oh my God, I don't know y'all. I just been feeling so grateful, so blessed this whole freaking trip. Cause honestly y'all, I want to say probably about like two years ago, like what I can afford now, I was not in the position to be able to afford like I am now. And it's just so crazy how God can just take you in whatever situation you in and turn it all the way around. Wow, I'm really blessed. You feel what I'm saying? Like I'm really blessed and highly favored. It just feels so good to really be one of God's favorites. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. <laughs> But no, let me tell y'all about this man that I had met yesterday, okay? <laughs> I guess he was really feeling your girl. So don't get me wrong. Like, I know I'm pretty, but I just really wasn't on that type of time. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm on vacation, so I really don't want to be bothered. But he was so persistent. He was just like, yeah, I want to take you out. I want to do this. I want to do that. Da, 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 da. He bought your girl a drink. Me and my girlfriend bought us both drinks, okay? And offered to buy his food later on that night. I was just like, ugh. <laughs> sorry please leave me alone like y'all if you know you know like literally my profession is finessing like literally that's what i get paid to do is finesse baby i'm on vacation i don't be i don't want to i don't feel like doing all that okay i'm not in the strip club right now baby i'm on vacation please leave me alone i don't want to see nobody i don't want a man in my face like unless you about to give me some money i don't want you in my face like and that's just straight up and it's not that he wasn't trying to give me no money but it was just you know what i'm saying it's just what you gotta do for all that extra stuff and i was just was not in the mood he was just like yeah i'm gonna pay for y'all jet 
skis tomorrow da, 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 da. so tomorrow came which is today right and so we hit him up i had gave him my girlfriend number but i pretend like it was my number so we hit him up right so while we was calling him a girl's picture popped up because because uh, out here they contact through whatsapp they don't contact through normal phone so when you call out on whatsapp it's like a little picture that pop up so so i'm just like it's giving you're using your girlfriend phone it's giving that really wasn't your phone you feel what i'm saying like it's really giving like what like and he never answered the phone y'all so i was just like how you gonna tell me you gonna pay for my jet skis you gonna do this you gonna do that and then when i call your phone you don't answer <laughs> you don't answer like i'm that's that's crazy like that's crazy it don't matter where you go a man will be a man like <laughs> a man is gonna be a man like that is so crazy to be like you know i'm not even gonna worry about it it's not that i can't afford my own jet skis it's the principle that you told me you was gonna pay for my jet skis so that's what i was looking for to, to stop playing with me today we have went to goodman's bay right it's another beach and um we have met this dude or whatever Cause we was about to head back to the crib so we had met this dude or whatever and he was just like where y'all from da, 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 da. so we had a small conversation y'all and i definitely got a free ride out of him yeah since you want to talk to me talk ain't cheap to me i'm gonna need something like what do dudes really be thinking like talk is cheap like you're gonna give me something if you want my conversation you're gonna give me something oh my god y'all it's raining again <laughs> hold on what's up you guys so your girl finally made it back to the room and let me just put y'all on let me just tell y'all how my day literally went left like didn't even go the duration that I planned it okay so today we were supposed to go atv riding and when we got to the spot where we were supposed to go atv riding the lady had an attitude she had a nasty ass attitude for one and then for two she had caught when we first caught on the phone we was like yeah can two people get on one atv ride she was like yeah so when we pull up she's like oh no i don't know who told you that but um that's not how it work you have to pay for you and you have to pay for you even though it's one atv ride and so my whole thing was but that's not what you said on the phone okay my thing is if that was the case i would have definitely not booked it you feel what i'm saying because 400 dollars for two people to get on one bike is insane like so i ended up getting to the lady so i'm like rubbing my coins like give me my refund back honestly i wasn't even trying to go down that route <laughs> like honestly i wasn't even trying to get ghetto with her get loud with her none of that but she made me get loud and ghetto because she tried to dismiss me on some have a good day like no i'm not done talking for one i'm not done talking you're not about to dismiss me like i'm some little girl like absolutely not so me and her we got into it my whole thing is how you gonna say one thing on the phone and then when we get there you say another thing but mind you here here's where my frustration came out the taxis the, the transportation out here is ridiculous okay let's just start right there ridiculous they don't have uber out here you either catching a taxi or you get on a bus that runs on its own time like it does not even have a schedule so i had to pay 30 dollars to get there just for you to tell me that i have to pay for the other person too like that's not what you said over the phone you feel what i'm saying so by that time i was out of 30 dollars then i had to pay 30 more dollars just to get back home so i was very irritated at that point i'm like you know what refund me back my money then she was acting like she didn't want to refund me back my money. She was like, I don't even have to refund your money if you're being real. And I was like, yes, the hell you do. Like, what you think this is? Like, you're not about to keep my money. Like, I paid $200 for that ACB ride. You're not about to keep my $200. Like, I don't care. Like, run with my coins. Like, I don't care. Like, we can do this all day. I have nowhere to be. Like, nowhere to be. So I just ended up going to this place called Fish Fry, getting me some food, and just coming back to the crib. Because she just blew me like when i say blew me really blew me i didn't understand everybody's trying to get out how they live i get it okay i get it like that's how we are in america too like we're trying to get out how we live but it's just it's not what y'all do is how y'all do it you feel what i'm saying for example we was on the beach trying to get some water because we was thirsty this dude gonna talk about some what y'all looking for we like some water he gonna say oh two bottles for five dollars two bottles of water for five dollars like i'm not paying that like i really could be rich and i'm still not paying for certain things like it gotta make sense to me and i understand i'm in a whole nother country i get it like i get it i'm not retarded like but it's just the simple fact that like i just feel like some stuff must just be od like i feel like they really be going overboard with their prices and i really just don't even be cut for it like i'm good love and joy so i just ended up going to this place called fish Run got me some food and drunk me some water over there because i'm not no absolutely not like they really blew me today like literally blew me today but i'm about to chill out for the rest of the day probably eat something 
watch TV for the rest of my time being here, y'all, and then head to the airport tomorrow. Y'all, but that's how my day went today. I was just so irritated, so blown. Like, and then on top of that, I feel like I wouldn't have been as blown if she didn't have a nasty attitude. Because it's like I said, it's not what you do, it's how you do it. You don't talk to people like you lost your mind. Like, you're not about to handle me any type of way. I'm sorry, I'm not that type of girl. Like, I don't know what other Americans you ran into handling them like that, but you definitely not about to handle me, okay? <laughs> but y'all, I'm about to chill out for the rest of the day. Probably watch TV and chill for the rest of the day until I catch my flight tomorrow. So I will see y'all tomorrow. <laughs> All right, y'all. So your girl is finally back home. Like, ugh. <laughs> It feels so good to be back home. Not even gonna lie to y'all. Don't get me wrong. Like I definitely enjoyed the Bahamas. Definitely had a mother time. It definitely did. But you know what I'm saying? It's no place like home. Seriously. Like, like I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Those prices out there really was doing a number on your girl. And I'm just like, dang. Like to eat. Just to eat. Y'all. Just to survive. Like I don't know how the Bahamians. Bahamians. I don't know how you say it. I don't know how they do it. But I just want to say shout out to y'all because y'all doing y'all thing. Like, it's so expensive out there to live. And I'm just like, I just couldn't imagine paying the prices that they pay to survive. Like, like their gas out there is seven whole dollars. I couldn't imagine putting seven dollars per gallon in my tank. Like, I couldn't imagine. Like, literally couldn't imagine, y'all. So, like I said, like, huge shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? They really out there doing a big one because I couldn't imagine trying to survive with those type, those, with those type of prices. Like, I honestly think it's just so insane. Like, everything out there is so expensive, y'all. I paid $2 for a bottle of water that was this big when I had went out to eat, y'all. Literally, this freaking big. So, I just want to say shout out to y'all. <laughs> shout out to y'all. Most of the Bahamas really taught me a lot and it really showed me that I really need to be grateful for what I have because I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Like in America, we really haven't made, like let's talk about it, like we really haven't made out here. Like like compared to their prices, our prices are great. Our prices are beautiful, okay? I know when our gas inch up to $3, we be tight, boy. We be living. Like I know I do. And when a gas go up to $3, y'all, I be tight. Like I'm like, okay, not going nowhere today because I'm not putting $3 in my tank for gas like so just going out there and seeing their prices like gas seven dollars milk ten dollars cereal ten dollars really opened my mind up to another light and i'm like i really need to be grateful for what i have because it can always be worse like real talk it really can overall i really had fun on this trip i'm just so happy that i got the chance to experience it i was able to go out there for my 27th birthday really blessed grateful and definitely highly favored i just want to say thank you so much for watching this vlog y'all do not forget to tell me happy birthday in the comment section below i love you guys so much this is going to conclude the video and i'll see you guys in my next one <laughs>